What's going on guys? So today we are at Smoky Mountain Canine Sports for a dock diving competition. Um, it's a fun jump. Um, it's not a huge giant competition like we go to from time to time, but these are a blast. These are the best warm-ups for those big competitions. There's always a lot of competition here. And there's a lot of really good dogs that come out to these fun jumps. So it's gonna be a good time. For anybody that's not familiar with dock diving, there are three disciplines in dock diving. You have speed retrieve, you have big air, and you have extreme vertical. Big air is how far the dog can jump, and there's different divisions that your dog can jump in. So the farthest jumping dog of each division will win first place, second place, third place, and it's graded by where the base of the dog's tail lands. So first we got big air. Uh, Kyra is usually anywhere between 19 and 21 feet. It's her first competition of the year, uh, live competition of the year, other than the online fantasy league. And uh, so we could be a little rusty. A lot of distractions out. We'll see how it goes. So we just jumped big air and Kyra jumped 21.6 and then also a 20 foot around four inch jump. Um, that's not gonna get us in the finals of our division, unfortunately. There's some really big jumping dogs here. 21.6 is not a small jump by any stretch of the imagination. It's 21 feet, six inches. With the dogs that are here, we are not gonna make it to the finals today. But we still got speed retrieve. We still got extreme vertical coming up. So maybe we'll be able to place in one of those two disciplines. Speed retrieve, which is exactly what it sounds like. How fast can your dog jump off the dock into the water, swim to the end of the pool, and grab the bumper? All right, so we did not place in speed retrieve either. Kyra's having a rough day. But to be fair on the speed retrieve, there's a reflection in the water right now. I would say probably 80% of the dogs uh, got lost in that reflection. Kyra got lost in the reflection of the water. She got turned around and that killed her time. That's just part of the game sometimes. Sometimes your dog just loses the bumper. It happens. There's not much you can do about it. But we still got extreme vertical coming up. Up next, we have extreme vertical, which is testing the vertical jump of your dog, where there is a buoy hanging, and every time your dog hits it, they go up another two inches, and another two inches, and another two inches, and another two inches, until your dog can no longer hit it. The highest jumping dog wins. We're hoping for a six foot eight vertical. Kyron's hit six foot eight before, but she's not consistent on it. So if we hit six foot eight, we'll call this a successful day. It is raining hard. Also, we got a little brother-sister competition. Kyra's brother uh, actually got to compete against Kyra in Extreme Vertical today. Her brother ended up winning the entire Extreme Vertical. Kyra's brother smoked us today. Good job, Jameson. Kyra's really upset that she lost to her brother. She told me that, you know, that, uh, that that's never happening again. She, she said that she'll make sure that never happens again. Jameson, good job, enjoy your win, but Kyra said she's coming for you in the next competition. No brotherly, sisterly love in dock dogs. None, it's dog eat dog. So we ended up going out in an extreme vertical at six feet, six inches, which is not six eight, but we'll take it. First competition of the year. Can't be too upset with six foot six, so. We'll take that, and I was wrong earlier. We actually did make the big air, big air finals. 
I'm going to try to film it if this rain will go away. Um, the competition goes on through the rain. We'll jump in the rain. We just won't jump in storms. As far as filming goes, I don't know how waterproof my camera is. Hopefully I can get this filmed. If not, I'll be right back and I'll let you guys know how we did in the finals and if we are going to come home with this dub or not. We need a personal best of 22 feet, 3 inches. She ain't never jumped that before. So the rain went away just in time to do, to film the finals. So here we go, finals. Kyra just hit 22.6, personal best, 22 feet, six inches. So we are taking home first place in the master division. We need 22.3 and we got 22.6, so let's go. So that is it for today's competition. Uh, Kyra got first place in big air master division and second place in extreme vertical. Overall, it's a good day. There was some big jumpers out there today. She did good. She's gonna take a nap, and I'm going to take advantage of her taking a nap by taking my own nap. Smoky Mountain Canine Sports, the facility that we're at today, I will link their information in the description down below so you guys can find them if you're interested in coming out here and doing some dock diving. If you're not in the Smoky Mountain area, then there are clubs all around you. If you Google dock diving clubs, you'll probably find some clubs in your area. Also, for you guys with high energy dogs, this, this is great for wearing your dog out. Your dog will sleep like a baby. You will have so much peace in your home for about four hours if you do. But Smoky Mountain Canine Sports will be in the description below. You guys can check them out. Go give them a like on Facebook and uh, they're always posting stuff and that's who Kyra is affiliated with, so. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you guys do like this kind of stuff, I may vlog a practice session with her and show you guys how we practice, how we get everything done. So if you did like it, just let me know in the comments, leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.